The Jamaica Football Federation's request for 15,000 spectators at the January 27 World Cup qualifier against Mexico at the National Stadium has been denied. The Federation is also looking at having interim head coach Paul Hall going beyond his initial six-match schedule. Jeremy Brown reports. The JFF had written to the government to request 15,000 spectators for the January 27 World Cup qualifier against Mexico at the National Stadium. The request came on the heels of government approving 5,000 spectators for the November 16 qualifier against the USA. But the request has been denied, leaving the JFF hierarchy disappointed. The numbers will therefore remain at 1,000 spectators for the grandstand and 4,000 for the bleachers. We understand, yes, but we are obviously disappointed because the fact is that we want to be able to make some money from get some returns, some, you know, that we can offset some of the costs that we have. So we are disappointed in the fact that we weren't able to get at least half the stadium, but we do understand what is happening. The new strain of virus may have caused um, the government not to increase their amount. In the meantime, JFF General Secretary Dalton Bint says things are being put in place to make the online purchase of tickets for the match a smoother process than it was in November. What we want to do is to, to look at the categories and look at the certification in terms of the vaccination. We want to look at and to see if the persons that who have already been authorized and certified, you know, could just go in and, 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 and apply for their ticket. So that's something that we're looking at, and to reduce the wait time. Meanwhile, in expressing confidence in newly appointed interim head coach Paul Hall, Wint hinted that the local governing body was interested in having the England-born former reggae boy remain at the helm beyond the six remaining World Cup qualifying matches. I know Paul is a very qualified person, and um, mm -hmm. I expect that he will perform well for the next six games, and um, hopefully with the results, um, it would be an easier sell for him to continue the role of um, the head coach. But it's not undue pressure we are putting on Paul. He understands the position that we are in. We want to qualify. We still want to qualify, and that's why we have made the change to see if we are able to qualify so that expectation is there. The reggae boys are lying in sixth place on seven points in the eight-team final round of CONCACAF World Cup qualifying. They'll also play away to Panama on January 30. Jeremy Brown reporting for TVJ Sports.